howdy. I'm CyberAct with all wonders like how to end the day we're going to be talking about AI thumbnails and thumbnails in general. I've been getting a lot of comments, a lot of hate on my uh, AI thumbnails, so let's just have a talk about it. It's it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. So, let's look at <clears throat> My thumbnails. So here's my number one video, the 101,000 views, uh, no thumbnail at all, just a white picture. Uh, here's my next ones. These are pretty old. They go down, look pretty good. And then I've got recent one. I've been doing more AI versions, and and people say, oh, these are these are so lazy. Oh, so lazy, Cyber. Why don't you just pay somebody? Just pay somebody to make your thumbnails, Cyber. Just take your time and make your own Cyber. AI thumbnails suck, Cyber. Well, let's do some math. So, <clears throat> I've done um, 500 videos. And it cost me about two dollars and fifty cents to three dollars per thumbnail. So we'll say two seventy five. So it would cost me thirteen hundred and seventy five dollars to have my guides have paid thumbnails. Okay. I can't afford this. I've made twenty three dollars in five years making these guides so that means i'd have to come out with thirteen hundred and fifty two dollars for in the last two years about eight hundred dollars or seven hundred dollars a year just for thumbnails so that you guys stop harassing and bitching at me just they don't do anything they don't change the views they don't change how many views we get or how many people watch stuff. The the title and YouTube putting it up or whether I put it on my website, it's like 80% of all of my views come from my website and Google. They're not coming from YouTube. They're not coming from people seeing a thumbnail. The thumbnail means nothing other than it pisses off a very small vocal minority of the community that just can't help themselves but download downvote the video because it had an AI thumbnail or because they just hate anything that says AI or they hate anything that, you know, isn't perfectly what they want. So instead of watching the content and actually using the guide, which the thumbnail you only see for a second and then the thumbnail is gone and you just go into the video, they down, downvote it, comment on it. So let's say... The next thing you're going to say is, well, Cyber, just make, the, make them yourself. So let's say it takes me 20 minutes to make them because I have to open Adobe. I have to gather the assets. I have to cut them out. I have to put it together. I have to export it. I have to change the format. I've got to upload it, and I've got to make sure it's the right size. So say 20 minutes each times 500 videos. That's 10,000 minutes. So 10,000 minutes divided by 60 minutes for hours. That's 166 hours in two years so 80 hours i have to spend making thumbnails this year that's two weeks of a full-time job making thumbnails or i could make um let's see so I can make, let's times this by 60 for minutes. Oops. 83 times 60 divided by 20. I can make 249 more guides in the time that it would take me to make custom thumbnails. Because it only takes me 20 minutes to make a full guide. I don't do any editing. I don't open up any software. I literally just start recording like I am now, I finish recording and I upload it to YouTube and I'm done. If I want a thumbnail, I go to ChatGPT, I put in to a thing I already have, D 
do this, and in five seconds, it kicks me out a thumbnail. I rename it, and I upload it to YouTube, and I'm done. So 21 minutes, I can make a full guide with a thumbnail ready to go. Or in 40 minutes, I can make a full guide and a thumb custom thumbnail. Or I could spend $800 this year and buy them but I don't have $800 to spend to buy them. So if you don't like my thumbnails and you would like better thumbnails, then you have a few choices. You could make the thumbnails for me and send them my way. You could send me money and I'll put that money towards getting thumbnails made, or you can shut the fuck up and stop downvoting my thumbnails and just enjoy the guides for what they are and if you don't have anything nice don't say anything at all how about that um those are kind of your your three choices continuing to harass me about it every time i post a guide to help someone um is just going to get you blocked or i'm just going to leave that community because i'm just i'm tired of it i'm tired of daily harassment um, today was another day is like just another day of just harassment. As soon as I post anything, if it says AI in it, or if it's HD, or if it's bedrock versus Java, or if it costs money versus free, or if it has poly meshes versus cubes, the community, some douchebag in the community has to pop up and say something hateful or say something every single time. Uh, it, it's just toxic. So once again, I can't afford thumbnails. I'm not making enough money doing guides to cover $800 a year to get thumbnails made. I would like to make a lot more guides and get more information out there to help more people because people are asking for guides constantly. But then if I don't put the right thumbnail on it, I get abused for it. Nobody's coming around saying, hey, Cyber, thanks for making 500 fucking guides. Instead, I just get abused and bashed for using a AI thumbnail. Are you guys kidding? Get your priorities in line. Maybe get some professional help. If you're one of those people that's out there and you can't help yourself but bash other people when they do something you don't like, even though they didn't ask you, they, they didn't engage you, you went out of your way to bash other people because you don't like something they're doing, get professional help, please. That's a mental illness. That's not normal. That's not healthy. Normal people don't go to Walmart and see someone do something and stop them and start harassing them over it. That's not normal. So please stop. If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. Don't downvote stuff because of a thumbnail. Watch the guide. If you don't like the guide in the video, then downvote it. Like, have some honor. So, there you go. That's why I'm using AI thumbnails. I can't afford it. It's between food and meds or not pissing you guys off with thumbnails. And sorry, I think eating and having meds is and not hurting constantly is more important to me and my mental well-being and my health than you guys bashing me all the time. Now, we could have both. I could have food and I could have meds and I could use AI thumbnails and then you could just shut the fuck up and we could all be happy. Well, you won't be happy, but you don't need to tell me when you're not happy. That's not how the world works. So once again, I'm Cyberax with Outlandishly Crafting. And again, I'm sorry for having to do another one of these videos, but I don't know what else to do. I'm at the point where I want to leave the Minecraft community completely and not be part of it because of the daily harassment. Because, uh, and if your goal, if you're out there and you're harassing me and your goal is to get me to leave, you're doing a pretty good job of it. Um, and I hope that you can't sleep at night once I do leave because of people like you. I hope that you toss and turn um, because you harass people until they quit. What kind of person does that in a creative community? Not a very good one.